idea what what's your age gap well listen for me morally. well no listen for me personally the idea of me as a man at a certain age dating or being intimate with a young lady that could be the age what's of my your age daughter, gap yeah. what i mean but so as shannon laid it out 30 that's i mean for me no maybe five 30 years 10 years no 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 no. i'm saying no 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 no. my personal age gap what i would okay. prefer to date Thank you. is within five to ten years okay, that's you, what you, i would date you know you know right? you, well, when men have an age women have they actually done surveys like uh men uh, prefer a, a women in an age range not age gap right between the ages of 18 and 26 and they actually did a survey from from age 60 from age uh, 18 to 60 they prefer women between the age ranges of 18 or 19 and 26. that's what they prefer it has nothing to do with an age gap women Wait, 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 wait. Hold, 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 hold on, hold on. Can I finish my, hold on, let me finish no, my talk. I, I just, I just want you to clarify that because you threw and you said they, so I'm going to ask you. In other words, in, in, in other I'm, words. I'm, I'm asking for the source of that. Study. The source of the source of it is OK Cupid has 23 million, uh, 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 23 okay. million, uh, OK Cupid. Go look it up. OK, okay. Cupid. Okay. Okay, Cupid. Yeah, they have 23 million 23 members. 23 million users. And they actually did a survey, right, about what what men prefer right and they actually they actually they actually said it right they actually pointed to there's a from six from 18 to 60 men prefer women and shannon can actually tell you because that's what he prefers a, a age range of between 19 and 26. that's I mean, what kevin they prefer said, kevin is I believe uh, alluded uh, kevin I is believe. alluded to that it, that's never okay. been a gap that's their and, sex prime let me give you the second half which i was trying to get to right wait 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 i just okay, i just need to be clear I'll, on this I'm, can, I'm, can, can, I can i get to the uh, you can ask me after let me get to the second okay. half right and then you can ask me because you asked me like three times right i'm trying to get to the second half women prefer women prefer a uh, uh, age gap of, of between between two and three years the men that they prefer <laughs> is between two and three years the, for, to women there's an age gap so from 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 ages basically from ages 25 to like 45 they want to marry a man between the age between an age gap of two and three years in fact if you go look at the at the, at the uh, age gap in marriage for women it's like two or three years the men they want a man two or three years older than them that's consistent across the board we, actually, we just did a uh, did a chart and a study about that me and dr johnson did that about three months ago okay that's the difference now you can ask me a question when you said that God. men prefer across the board, across mm -hmm. all ethnicities, racial boundaries, whatever, mm -hmm. they prefer women mm -hmm. 18 to 26. Yes. Okay. Facts. To marry. Realty. Realty. To, to date, to marry, to have sex with. That's what I they mean, prefer. I'm not talking about to have sex with. I'm talking about to marry. And yes. Families with yes. What I yes. 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 That's what it's about. Yes, that's their that's prime. Why, that's listen, why. The wait, 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 fam, wait, 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 please, gentlemen. I'm okay. asking a question for clarity. I've asked it like ten no, times. Wait, wait, yes. <laughs> wait, wait, hold, on. bro, please, elder. Listen, I'm asking a question as you're talking. I'm writing down. I'm trying to understand. Seems like the gentleman is saying something that I don't know. So I'm just really trying to let y'all know I'm not coming from a disingenuous I, 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 place. I, I, I literally we got you. We're, we're not. Wait, hold on. Uh, we're not going to speak Chicago. We're not going to speak until you say go. So go ahead and finish. No, no, no. I just I'm just trying to let guys know. Like I literally am sitting here listening to y'all and trying to understand because in my world, in my observable eye, I don't see that number one, and I can see that that's anecdotal. Number two. I understand the difference between what a man will play with and what a man will commit to and wife. So if you're telling me that men, and there's a study out there that says men by and large, regardless of age, whether he's 70, 60, 50, 40, 30, prefer women that's 18 to 26. And I think I've seen at least three other brothers chime in and agree and say, yes, that's the case. Then I'm going to go and look up OK Cupid. All I was asking was clarifying questions, gentlemen. That's it. I, I, I mean, yeah. I mean I now look, look. Okay. So here's a, here's a, here's the here's the thing, and I throw it back to you, BGS. The reason why it's not necessarily anecdotal is because they, the the study that OK Cupid did is asking men what they want. It's not necessarily 
what they speaking get? to what men actually get. You see, it would work be, be, when you say it's anecdotal yeah. and, and that's not what you're actually seeing in the streets. It's because the, the girls that are actually 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, and 26 aren't necessarily picking all the older guys. Yes. So, right. it's, so even though so so even though you got a ton of men walking around 40, 50, 60 years old looking for young girls that's 23, them young 23-year-old girls ain't checking for them older men. Yes. And you so that's saying, why you won't see saying, it anecdotally. No, 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 no the he anecdotal was saying, I was saying is mine is. Right. Yeah, Thanks. he wasn't he wasn't challenging the study. Okay. The clip that you just heard uh, was from Shannon Rawls. I was just on last night. Probably should have had my old ass in bed, but I don't know why. You know, if I listen to somebody and there's something that I think is probably incorrect, I have a habit of jumping on and putting my two cents in a pot. And sometimes <laughs> your two cents isn't wanted. <laughs> but anyway, this is like toward the tail end. And, and this is me and Chicago really going back and forth about not necessarily age of consent, which was part of it, but also why people believe there's an age gap. That's what I wanted to find out. What informs him morally that there should be an age gap or a certain age gap between uh, men and women, especially what men like versus what they get. And, uh, and I gave him a stat about an age range, as you can hear. I said, men have an age range that they like and women have an age gap that they like. So. I gave him a study, I think it was done in 2014 by uh, OK Cupid, and it's actually printed in not only Dataclism, but also on their blog. And I remembered it. It got a funny mind, even though it was seven, eight years ago. I remembered them printing this, and I remember the the desirability chart that they printed between men, and I saw the, the big difference there was between men and women. And I quoted him a gap, you know, out of my memory of me, me memorizing it, right? that it was between the ages of 18 and 20, 18, 18 and 26, because peak age for a woman to get married is 26. I got other studies that I had to go find if you want that one, okay? I have to go dig this stuff out. But I actually went back and, and found the chart. And the chart actually is more narrow than I actually stated. It's actually between the ages of, of 20 and 22, according to OKCupid. Okay so I gave, actually gave it a little bit more leeway than the study actually gave. Okay, uh, it's actually a very narrow range of uh, present the chart and you actually see the other chart with women. Women actually is almost like linear. As they age, they like a man closer to their age, as you can see in the other charts, because women have an age gap, as I said, and men have an age range. So I'm actually gonna read the uh, article that came with it where I first saw it, which is Business Insider. I've shown the chart and actually I'm gonna read the article that came along with it. This is from 2014 Business Insider. Dataclism shows men are attracted to women in their 20s. Charts, guys like women in their early 20s regardless of how old they get. It's a common cliche that older men chase much younger women. But charts from the book Dataclism provide real evidence that men at every age are consistently most attracted to women in their early 20s. Dataclism author and OKCupid co-founder Christian Rudder uses numbers from the dating site to show how men and women differ in the ages of the people they're attracted to. This is what I was trying to tell Chicago Gorilla, right? Men, regardless of age, tend to say women in their early 20s look best, while women are most attracted to men their own age. For the people in the back, Men, regardless of their age, tend to say women in their early 20s look best, while women are most attracted to men their own age. This this is the, uh, they show the linear line and they show you the, basically the ages from, you know, between 20 and 24. You can actually look at it. And I think the chart here stops at 50. And I think that's in an extended chart all the way up to 60. But we're going we're gonna to give it from, from, from 20 to 50, okay? That should be pretty close, right? Dataclism, who we are when we think no one's looking, right? A, a woman's age versus the age of men who look best to her. And you can see that, as I said, women like men between the, the ages of two or three years. 
and you look all the way down at 50, women at 50, even though they like younger men, basically for the most part, they like men between the ages of uh, uh, two or three years older when they're basically, uh, I think it's less than 40, and I think a little bit younger, you know, two to three years younger when they're over 40, according to this, what they desire. To make these charts, Rudder looked at the preferences of OkCupid okay users. As you can see, a woman's taste in men typically evolves as she ages, while the men's taste in women stays the same no matter how old, how old he gets. But there's another layer to this data. Although men at every age seem to be attracted to very young women, they most often message women who are closer to their own age. The age range of women, uh, the age range of women, men say they're most interested in tend to fall uh, within their own age range. In other words, what Shannon was telling, what Shannon was saying is that at the end of the day, men are very practical about what they think they can get, what they want versus what they can get. They desire a woman between a narrow age range, but at the end of the day, men are very practical. What can I get at the end of the day? Women, older women as they age, this, what they desire is something that's closer to their age, something that's closer to them. And since w women, w women or you know, women accept the offer, men wind up with women their own age within two or three years, as I said. So that's the study. Men prefer, when, if, if, if men could get what they really wanted, they get women in a narrow range. Women, since they can accept or, or can check for men their own age, they tend to get men closer to their age, which is why women get pissed off because they think men want what they want and it's not the truth. So, you know, sometimes I, I prefer guys telling me that I'm full of shit and they don't believe it. And a lot of guys think that I pull shit out of my ass, that you're pulling shit out of your ass and where, you know, I say there's a study and I'm bullshitting and uh, you're going to go look it up, which you may or may not. So I'm going to beat him to the punch. I'm going to produce the video, show you the chart, put the link in. OK, uh, the data clips, I, could, I didn't find the actual data clips article. I do believe it's in a blog, but I actually pointed you to the uh, business insider study that shows the chart. If you want to pull it up, uh, the, the chart was actually published uh, in several different blogs because it was actually shocking to people who actually see this kind of data. And said, and hardly any, like I said, men actually go after what they think they can get. Men are very pragmatic about dating, very pragmatic about dating. But the thing is, what they desire, what they can get, men actually go for what they can get. They don't want to waste their time. And said, and men hardly, hardly any men in their 30s message 20 year old women. It still it's harder for women to find a mate as they get older. Rudder wrote the blog post for OK Cupid in 2010. A man, as he gets older, searches for a relatively younger and younger women. Meanwhile, his upper acceptable limit hovers only a token amount above his own age. I can, as an older man, I can claim to accept that because, yeah, as you get older, you know, like you know, where I am in my 60s, I'm, <clears throat> I am not checking for a woman in my, in my 70s, in her 70s. I am not. Trust me, I've been offered, but I am not. So, yeah, you know, as you get older, yeah, you, uh, you got to push downward. When I was younger, it was, you know, when I went, personally, when I was younger, it was plus or minus 10. That used to be my age range. You know, you, you know, at the point when you get in your 20s, you can't, you're 25, you can't go after 14 year olds, right? At least not in California. So, but as I got older, when I, once I got to 30, it was plus or minus 10 up until I said, up until my mid fifties. And now it's, you know. I think my right now it's plus five and probably got minus 15. So it is, you know, even though the gap is, you know, that there's an age range of 20 years, the numbers have been jiggled around. But I just wanted to put that out there, post this real quick because um, I throw out numbers, I throw out studies and people say I'm full of shit. It, you know, sometimes uh, I, I quote charts out of my head, right? Because I remember the stuff, I remember seeing the stuff. Uh, I remember relatively where it is, thank God, for Google and search engines so I can, you can actually pull it up. I know the stuff exists. Sometimes I have it on my hard drive. I just have to go find it. Like This is like seven, eight years old. But I remember seeing this, so when during the conversation, I remember seeing this stuff. I remember seeing the survey. I remember who did it. And again, 
that's the old encyclopedic memory bringing stuff out. And trust me, you know, I would say that Chicago Gorilla is different than everybody else, but no, I always get pushed back on stuff that I quote because people have a worldview and I shock their worldview when I say stuff. Even though the men on the panel agreed with me when I said it, it's still shocking to him. And he should have just said, I'm full of shit, which is he respectfully, really respectfully, that's really what he said. BGS, you're full of shit. And I don't believe it because that's not what I see. And you got to prove to me that there's a study exists that says what you're saying. But there it is. Read it for yourself. Take it for what it is. But like Shannon says, men ultimately go for after what they think they can get, which is also reflected in the study. Anyhow, with that, I'm going to jump off here. This is BGS out, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.